What's going on, Wacky Cat? Here we go again with the 2K ratings for WWE. 2K23, the ratings was not looking good. And 2K24, here we go again with the same old, same old. My opinion is this, man. This got to be some type of promotional thing to get people talking to get people riled up on purpose because i mean some of these ratings for some of these superstars doesn't make any sense whatsoever now i would say this with the women wrestlers they got the women the women wrestlers correct so far we don't got all the ratings but from the few we did Rhea Ripley a 96. I give her that. That's well deserved. Um, Tiffany uh, Stratton 79. Uh, Maxine Dupree 64. Uh, so yeah, I and I, I'm predicting that Bianca Belair, when her rating is revealed, and uh, Becky Lynch, they're gonna have 90 in the mid 90s. They always get the the women superstars correct. But when it comes to the men, it's absolutely positively ridiculous. And I have come to the point in my mind that I'm not taking this seriously anymore. I'm not getting riled up. I'm just going to, you know, go in the game manually and change the ratings like I always do. Because this is happening far too often that the ratings are not even close. It's like... I can see if, okay, you meet the person at the halfway mark of what the fans think the rating is, but it's so far from the reality of what these superstars do and accomplish that it's like, I can't even, I, they're losing credibility. They're gonna have to, for us, if they want us to take this rating seriously, they're going to have to have at least one game uh, as far as these recent 2K games, the 2K22, 2K23, and 2K24, have one of them where it's reasonable. Every, from 22 to 23 to 24, all of them have been absolutely ridiculous. No, I mean, superstars, I believe, are actually getting really upset because I feel I bet they feel real disrespected and now the ratings are getting promoted like never before with 2k24 because now raw the recent Monday Night Raw are revealing the ratings of the superstars why they're wrestling in the real product now some people say will say well they, they, this just is fake it is it it's, uh, you know, it's scripted, wrestling scripted, it's predetermined, who cares? Listen to me, man. We obviously know all these wrestlers, female, male, they work their tail off, they do travel, they, they, they put their bodies on the line, they get injuries. For you, I mean, what is this equating to? The storyline or that physical uh athleticism athleticism what what are these ratings going off is it going off storyline because it would offend to me it would these ratings will offend a superstar if i work my tail off just like that other guy or that other gal and you gave me a loaded rating and gave them a higher rating I'm assuming it's going off a storyline and I always try to make sense of this I try to make sense of last year's because last year's was kind of crazy too I said okay maybe they're going off storyline and they're going off that particular year they're not going from the whole legacy of that particular superstar like Kevin Owens let me see what he got uh, I think he's already Kevin Owens is a 86 the, you know last year and most of this year well this year just getting started kevin owens wasn't really doing nothing he was like a mid carter so I, I, if they're looking at it like that 
I can see get him giving him an, uh, an 86. But people are looking at this, if you ask me, as the legacy of these superstars. Like that's how you feel about him his entire career. His entire career, he was a 86. We know that's not true. But they're making a big, big deal about it. And now the commentator, Michael Cole, on the real product, Raw, uh, he mentioned, don't quote me on this, as I don't know exactly verbatim what he said, but he said some people are upset about their ratings. You don't, uh, uh, yeah. Why would they do that? And some of you may say this is not a big deal. You got to think, I, listen, the fans, we, you know, we can change it. But to these superstars, is this some type of strategy to make them, okay, I got I to gotta prove myself and I can, because I honestly believe, truthfully, that some of them might, might be hurt about this. Because forget the video game, forget the video game. I'm looking at some of these superstars, and I'm just speculating, could be looking at this like a s actual score or how you rate me. Forget the video game, forget the WWE game how you feel about me as a actual competitor as the wrestling product goes oh you think he's better than me you think she's better than me and I work just as hard so I, I, to, to me this is getting it's losing credibility man I don't know what it is these obviously are not accurate at all to the real product, even storyline, if you ask me. Gunther, Gunther is a 90. Give Gunther a 90. Logan Paul is a 92. <clears throat> well, he's a 90 also. Jay Uso is a 90. Cody Rose is 93. So, it, it's just irritating. It's irritating and it don't really have to be. It's, it's just unnecessary irritate irritant. Like you I mean, I I don't know this for certain, but I feel like this is irritating to see these superstars look at their rating like. Because back in the day, 2K17, 2K19, they didn't make a big deal about the rating. They didn't make a big deal about none of that. They just showed you the video game here. But now it's in, they're making it a big deal to get to, to, to get the hype. Oh, get, to make people mad, to make get them angry. But now it's getting to the point that this is just getting ridiculous. It's getting really disrespectful. So I have, uh, I mean, I would suggest the next video game, 2K25, that they actually come close to what the actual wrestler is rated. I don't know what they're trying to make us cause a controversy, I'm trying to make everybody talk about the game more, uh, controversy sales, but now it's not, it is, it's, this is not cute anymore, man. Okay, so like I said, we all gonna go, I know a lot of us is just gonna change the rating. Now, I we're gonna have a lot of work to do because there are so many Male superstars, their ratings are horrible. So I want this before I even play this game. I gotta go. We gotta change. Well, so if you if you like the rating, this is just my personal opinion. But gotta go change each and every one. Cody Rhodes, he's a 93, but that's wrong. He deserves to be higher. He, I mean, I'm not too mad at his rating. Uh, Gunther's too low. Drew McIntyre is a 89. What in the what is going on, man? What what is happening here? Come on, man. So Drew McIntyre, a WWE champion, multiple times. He's rated low. He's rated an 89. But Jay Uso, because he, he I, I'm not I'm listen. I don't got nothing against Jay Uso, but he's high by one point. Drew McIntyre don't only deserves to be a 90. He deserves to be like in the mid 90s. So how do you feel if you're Drew McIntyre? And now 
some of these i don't know i haven't seen all the reveals but some of if i'm not mistaken i could be mistaken i haven't seen it but they did it last year they at they they asked the superstar how do you feel about your rating like that's kind of like rude you rated the guy a real low rating how you feel about that and you know they're gonna play it off like oh i'm mad i'm mad but you know these people i mean these people got egos these people are athletes they, you know i know it's scripted and these th people think highly of themselves they think they're the best even though they're jobbers or middle card so to ask them how do you feel about being rated in the low 80s it's like irritating they're like come on it's it's unnecessary I, I can't wait to 2k24 but this is the most this is the whole thing is i'm not this is uncalled for i don't think these ratings this rating thing is a big deal obviously but it's like you're insulting the superstars I, and if you ask me like like i said before i know it's a video game and it's it, it, but it's like insulting them for no reason because you're saying that you you put me in the video game but this is from my real life wrestling so you put me in the video game and my real life rating is low it's a seven and the female and the male superstars that's got 60 rated our truth is 67 i mean i can't be mad you can't be mad at that uh like wow even our i I, mean, I don't know how these superstars thinking but now this this rating thing is being promoted and it's causing a lot of uh issues but obviously uh, to man to me this is a joke obviously this is to me this is on purpose man you i mean whoever doing this is just doing this for 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 i mean this is this is uncalled for to be doing this like the game is gonna look like it's gonna be great but i have to gripe on this this is silly again once again silly well anyway that's all i gotta say about that i'm wacky cat make sure you like the video make sure you subscribe to the channel and i'm out